This channel and this page on YouTube, Shorts, and TikTok are getting millions of views and thousands of subscribers just by telling football stories. Using the power of artificial intelligence, these channels have exploded, going from zero to over one million subscribers. For example, this channel has collected over 80 million views in this period and earns between $11,000 and $180,000 per month. Additionally, this TikTok page has amassed more than 500,000 followers and getting millions of views per month, these videos truly engage the audience insanely. I will show you how to create these videos so you can attract views through social media. But first, let's see what we will be creating. Do you ever wonder why footballers like Jude Bellingham cut holes in their socks? It's not a fashion trend, but a practicality. Modern football socks are super tight, and this can affect blood flow. Cutting holes helps improve circulation and helps prevent cramps during games. So that's why players, including superstars like Neymar and Saka, often sport socks with holes. To create a script, you should first visit Google Bard and ask it for two examples of football players' stories. Use these examples to create random stories, starting with a catchy phrase, or did you know, Please keep it to one paragraph and limit it to 50 words. Before clicking Generate, search for FC Motivate on YouTube and choose a video that interests you. Copy the video's link and paste it into an online video transcriber to get the text. Return to Google Bard and paste the transcribed text, then click Generate. That's it. Our next step is to use Speechimo AI to generate the voiceover from our script. To generate a voiceover using Speechimo, you need to click on the Speech Gen button. Next, you will be asked to enter a name for me. You can choose any name, but I suggest Leo. Then, you will need to select your preferred voice. Currently, Speechimo has six different voices available for you to choose from, and more may be added in the future. You can listen to each voice and pick the one that suits your preferences the best. For me, I prefer Ethan's voice. Once you've selected your preferred voice, simply input the text you want to use. To do this, you can go back to your Google Doc, copy the text you want to use, and paste it into Speechimo. Once you've done this, click on Generate, and Speechimo will automatically generate a human-like voiceover for you. You can listen to it to ensure that you're happy with the quality. Did you know that Lionel Messi almost gave up on football at the age of 14? This step is really simple. All you need to do is go to Google and search for images related to the topic of your video. For example, if your video is about Lionel Messi, search for Lionel Messi images on Google and download them. It's as easy as that. After you have downloaded the images, listen to the voiceover and choose the right images that match the content of your video. Ensure that the downloaded images are relevant to the topic of your video. To start editing the video, open any editing software. I will be using CapCut as usual. First, import all your files into CapCut. Then, drag the voiceover into the timeline. Next, remove any pauses in the voiceover by zooming into the timeline and cutting out the empty parts. After that, bring in all the images you downloaded online. Arrange them according to the voiceover to ensure each image is placed in the right place. Change the video ratio to 9 by 16 for a standard YouTube short frame size and increase the image size to fit the screen properly. To make the video more engaging for your audience, add transitions to the images, click on the transition icon at the top, and choose Overlay. Pick the transitions that fit your preferences. Remember, there's no right or wrong way to choose transitions. To add background music to the video, drag the desired music file into the timeline. Reduce the volume of the music so that it does not overpower the main voiceover. To add captions to the video, click on the text icon and select Auto Caption. Choose your preferred language and click on Generate. CapCut will automatically generate captions for your video. First, Go to the caption section under Templates and choose the one you prefer. Then, click on it and go back to the basic section. Here, increase the font size. I usually leave it at 15 and then increase the scale. Once you're done, you can export the video. But, 
If you're interested in another way to generate engaging captions for your video, search for SubMagic on your browser. To create a caption for your video using SubMagic, click on the Upload button and select your video. You can rename the file and select the language spoken in the video. For this video, it's English. After that, click on Upload, Next. Choose the caption style that you like. For me, I'll be selecting the Devon caption theme. Finally, click on Export. Now, let's see what we've created so far. Did you know that Lionel Messi almost gave up on football at the age of 14? He was homesick and missed his family in Argentina, but luckily his determination to play kept him going. Today, he's considered one of the greatest football players of all time. Thanks for watching.